Hi guys, it's Tom, my name's Tia, and today I'm going to be doing my baddie review, and I'm going to be getting ready at the same time, because I got shit to do. Been seen a lot on the internet, you know, of course, nothing's changed about that. And... Boy, do I have the tea. Ooh, eh, ooh, ah. I have the tea. So the episode started off with um, Scotty calling out Anna. And um, y'all know because I don't stay at the house. I ride up there with uh, DJ Sky. I don't know where she's staying. But we end up getting um, getting over there uh, together. And um, she's, you know, the whole time she's like, you know, she has a bone to pick with somebody. And I'm like, you know, well, if that's the case, you know, just make sure that, you know, you talk to them and stuff like that before, you know, it escalates. What happened? That, that did not happen. DJ Sky um, ran over to Anna and they start fighting. Um, and then while they're fighting, Scotty um, calls me out and she's like, you know, I want to talk to you about basically, you know, you yelling at me on a bus the other day. And I was like, girl, that was the other day. Like, if we had any type of issue, we should have handled it right then and there. Because right then and there, um, there was only uh, just some little camera like this in the bus. There was no security in there. Um, obviously, there wasn't an audience. Um, but she wanted to do that right then and there. But the thing is, the T is, I already had that information. A producer had came up to me. God, as, as much as people hate me, uh, there's just more people that love me. Let me tell you something. Because, um, yeah, I had already known that this was going down. Because I'm chilling, chilling, um, sitting in the house, just chilling, you know, before we about to leave and everything like that. And a producer comes up to me and is like, Scotty's about to approach you, basically. And I'm like, okay, um, th what are we doing? Like, does she want to fight? Like, how's it, what does she want to do? And basically... The producer's like, no, 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 please, no fighting. Um, that's not what we want. She don't want to fight. Um, but we do need to have some type of, you know, conversation between you two because she want to have a conversation. And I said, that's fine. We don't have to fight. But if y'all don't want to fight and y'all saying she don't want to fight, then cool. I don't want to fight either. It's fine. Like, that's not what I came here to do. But I get it. We're doing shit for baddies. It's TV. So let's go. That's the tea. Oh. I spilt it. I spilt it all over there. I spilt it all over this place. It's, on, it's only been like two minutes into this video. But that's how much tea there is. Mm. That's why I'm like, you want to hit me? You want to hit me? You really want to hit me? Like, they cut out a lot of stuff. Girl, we could have did that on the bus. Regardless whether I was taking my trauma out on her, whatever. If somebody was yelling at me the way I was yelling at myself, we would have been fighting. So, <laughs> it is what it is. Like, I thought that I was the only actress here. So I thought I was the only one that was booked on commercials and booked on movie sets. I didn't know that the rest of these hoes was also into that. I thought they were just into reality TV. Like, you wanted to have an acting scene with me. <laughs> so I gave her a little acting scene. It was cute. I seen Megan do her recap video and she was saying, you know, she doesn't really understand my personality. But that's only because Megan has seen me out in L.A. multiple times and has never gotten a chance to know me. Like, yeah, she and I may know the same people, but she don't really know me. And so she should be trying to figure it out or whatever. You know, like, you know, some people just be like, I can't I can't put my finger on it. I can't put my finger on it. It's because you're not meant to. I don't want you to put your finger on it. I want you to stay over there and I like to stay over here. Megan has said something about me in her video talking about. Um, oh yeah, like you're the type of person that throws rocks and then hides your hand or you're the type of person that be yelling and stuff like that. Girl, you come from reality TV too. I know you're doing shit for views on YouTube. We both getting our coin on YouTube. Cool, cool, cool. I'm happy for you. I think that's dope. Um, I also seen our basketball wives doing your thing too. So congratulations on all your success. But girl, you know how this shit go. Don't play stupid. You know exactly how this shit goes. So uh, I didn't fight her because the girl told me she didn't want to fight and the producers told me she didn't want to fight. So I was like looking at her like, you gonna hit me? You for real gonna hit me? Like, are we really gonna fight? Because they told me you said, <laughs> they told me you said you didn't want to fight. So I'm like, are you really gonna hit me? You gonna hit me? <laughs> because I thought that we were just kicking and just doing the little fight that we had to do for the show. <laughs> Uh, you know, I'm always going to be a team sport, but at the end of the day, shit, if we, I'm going to get that BTS over here on YouTube, okay, baby? I'm spilling the TTT, okay? Boom. And then there's one part where she yelled, she's like, that's why you something about an OG, bitch, or whatever. And 
I was gone. I had went somewhere else. Like, I was down the street. I went, um, a couple of the producers took me on a little walk and was like, you good? You did great. Yeah. <laughs> like, I, I don't know what she was talking about because she wasn't talking to me. She, you know, she know how to make sure that... <laughs> The, everything looked right for her, you know, and they know how to make it look right back. But fast forward, you know, I ended up going on the bus, which I was so happy to go on the bus because, um, honestly, I have like a little bit of fear to PJs. Like I, I've done the PJs before, um, and they're scary. They, they shake. Um, they sometimes people overpack them. Sometimes there's too many people on there. So I was like, you know, I haven't worked with this network before like that. Um, I think that's, that's a dope, you know, that they do have a PJ, but I've rode with Natalie on a PJ before. I've been on a PJ before on my own with a nigga. I used to talk, like, I've been doing the PJ shit. So for me, I was like, I would rather go on the bus and hang out with the girls that seem to be like more of the fun group. So when the producer had originally had came up to me and told me that Scotty didn't want to fight, I was like, cool. And they were like, yeah, you're probably going to go on the bus. I was like, cool. So I had already known all this shit beforehand. Like, don't y'all get it? Like, my name is T. I get the T. Like, and I don't even have to go, hey, y'all, what's going on? Hey, y'all, what's going on? People just come up to me and give me the information. So, that's what happened. Um, I get on the bus, and I'm looking forward to, you know, uh, getting to know the other girls and stuff like that. And then hanging out with Saya, because Saya is like my actual homegirl in real life. So, I'm like, oh, okay, cool, hang out with Saya, and then be, you know, hang out, sing, hang out with Sky, Camilla, um... And then, I mean, I didn't really know Anna and Smiley like that at the time. So, I was just more so just, you know. And, and I didn't really know uh, Tzatziki either. But Tzatziki was cool. I was like, she's cool. So, we all had a good time on that bus. Like, we really did. We made the best of it. It wasn't that long of a ride. But then, you know, I end up really getting sick. And I'll be like seeing some people talking about. And that's what really ticked me off. And this is what kind of ticked me off um, on uh, on set too. You know, like later on down the road. You know, I don't have to lie to kick it. Okay, bitch. And I don't have to lie to not kick it. I could just be like, how do I, I don't feel like coming and set. How about that? I don't feel like showing the fuck up. Because I'm really that bitch and I could do that. But that's not what the case was, ho. I was really actually fucking sick. I thought I had COVID. And I was like, shit. I'm like, what the fuck? So I was like, I, I took a COVID test. I didn't have COVID. So I was like, damn, I just had a real bad bug. I got Theraflu. I got the um, Dayquil, Nyquil. I tried to really like get my shit together. And I was like, there's no way. So... There was like, you'll see in the next up, the next episode. I really do like I'm I miss out on a couple like on a couple of things. Um, only because I wasn't feeling good, and for people to try to make it seem like I had to lie about anything to get my way, bitch, shut up. You're dumb. I don't have to lie about anything. It's more player when you keep it pee and you tell the truth, bitch. I would much rather tell the truth than uh lie to get my way. I'm too real for this shit. What are you talking about? So anyway, yeah, boom, I was sick because I'm human and bitches get sick too. Bad bitches get sick too. Hello. Sorry. And bro, they were blowing me up because I was in a hotel and everybody like, where's she at? Where's T at? I'm like, oh my God. Like, we just landed. Whatever you guys are doing, you guys can miss out one scene without T. Like, you don't need me. You know, like... So just go do whatever scenes you guys have to do. And when I feel better, I'll let y'all know and like feel better into the way where it's just like, you know, even if I wasn't completely put together, like completely, I would be a good sport and come back to set when I was like mobile. But there was a point where I was like, I had like the shape, you know, when you feel like you really sick, like I was like, oh my God, going back and forth to the bathroom, taking a shower, getting out of the shower. It sucked. And like I said, I really thought I had COVID, but thank God I didn't. So <sighs> I'm finally happy I got that get that off my chest because the people was pissing me off like acting like I have to lie to be sick it wasn't even just the commenters it was people on set trying to act like that too like what the fuck why would I have to lie even the um security guard on uh that we had on our bus he was like telling me I was coughing and stuff a little bit beforehand when before we had got to Philly and he was like um T, you getting sick. And I told him, don't say that. Don't say I'm getting sick because when people say that, then you get sick. Mm, little asshole, I got sick. It, it was what it was. Like, everything happens for a reason. Fast forward to, I mean, I guess, like, the preview. Everybody's, like, you know, wondering what the hell happened with the preview and stuff like that. I don't know this girl. I don't care about this girl. I don't even care to mention this girl's name. I feel like I'm giving to charity by even calling her this girl. Watch. Just watch. Everything that the majority rule is... That's, uh, this girl is a follower. Daddy, why?
They are not lying. Like, girl, like, why couldn't nobody hear what you were saying when you was talking to me in that preview? Oh, because you wasn't mic'd. Nobody gave a fuck. You talked to me first. I wasn't even talking to you. Why would I talk to you? Who are you? I don't know you. I don't know you, girl. You don't know me. You were standing there next to Roly trying to put in your two cents, unmiked, for no stupid ass reason. And we got in a fight for no stupid ass reason. Dumb. And I hear people talking about she talking about the people told her she had to hold back or she couldn't fight the way that they do on the other network she was on. Okay, girl, they were probably talking about as long, but you still fought with me and we still got down, bitch. So what are you talking about? Like, how can you even hold back on a bitch if you fighting somebody? And y'all talking about I put my bag down? Yeah, I put my bag down because the girl kept inching closer and closer to me, staring at me the whole time. And she tried to blame it on me that I was staring at her. No, girl, you were staring at me. You were staring at me first while I'm talking to Rolly. You... What the hell? Who is this? Oh, poor ugly looking thing. I'm like, what is going on? Like, what are we doing here? But you'll see. And I'll get into that more that rec on, on our recap on that when the uh, when, uh, episode dropped. Because I don't... You know, I want to spill too much tea, but it's piping hot tea. But God bless me and God bless you. And thank you for watching this video and um, liking and commenting and subscribing because you know you're supposed to do that. Um, but basically, yeah, um, stay tuned for my next YouTube video. <laughs> Bye, y'all.